Imagine, if you will, sitting down to your morning coffee, turning on your home computer to read the day's newspaper. Well, it's not as far-fetched as it may seem. In fact, both local San Francisco papers are investing a lot of money to try and get a service just like that started. Science editor Steve Newman reports on one person already using the brand new system. Social media is the best opportunity this industry has ever had to communicate and reach outside to different people, new markets, and increase the potential for business, for cultural expansion, just to keep this entire heritage alive. What we're trying to do here is take this um, once in a lifetime opportunity to enter a medium that allows us to speak to millions of people. Uh, people who may appreciate what we do, but also, and most importantly, people who do not know what we're doing and may not appreciate what it is that we do. So the industry as a whole has a, an incredible chance right now to reach out and be known. Um, we believe it's extreme impo extremely important for communication to take place, uh, not in the usual standard methods, but again, trying to reach new audiences, new interests, and just try to tell the story of what it is that, that we do, whether it's manufacturing, whether it's organizing, this whole world, this whole, what I call industry, firearm industry, um, it needs to be communicated. It needs to be talked about. And again, social media is probably the best way to do it right now. It's extremely affordable, it's extremely easy, and it's a possibility that we believe we should be jumping on. I always thought that we had a lot of arguments speaking for our industry and our sector. But honestly, we had a lot of problems in getting these messages across to um, our opponents. And it is therefore that we have enjoyed one day of uh, education regarding social media and communication. And Professor Luminati has done that in a splendid way. than fashionable cubby hole of the San Francisco Examiner. These editors are programming today's copy of the paper into that same Ohio computer. When the telephone connection between these two terminals is made, the newest form of electronic journalism lights up Mr. Howard.